Hi everyone, welcome back to Spark Plug Tech. Today, we're exploring the basics of an RC circuit, a simple combination of a resistor and a capacitor. These circuits are essential for understanding concepts like charging, discharging, and timing. Let's get started. An RC circuit combines a resistor and a capacitor in series or parallel. These circuits are fundamental in electronics, often used for timing, filtering, and signal processing. In today's video, we'll focus on a series RC circuit and observe how the capacitor charges and discharges. When a voltage is applied to an RC circuit, the capacitor starts to charge through the resistor. The charging follows an exponential curve, and the voltage across the capacitor increases over time. The voltage across the capacitor at any time, T, is given by this formula. Vc equals the input voltage times 1 minus e to the power of negative t over Rc. The product Rc is called the time constant, which determines how quickly the capacitor charges or discharges. Similarly, during discharging, the capacitor releases its stored energy and the voltage drops exponentially. Now, let's build and simulate an Rc circuit in Tinkercad. We use a 10K omega resistor, a 100 microfarad capacitor. As you can see, the capacitor's voltage gradually increases. Follow the exponential curve we discussed earlier. Now, let's disconnect the power source and observe the capacitor discharging to the resistor. Notice how the voltage decreases exponentially. RC circuits have numerous applications. They're used in timing circuits like blinkers or oscillators and in filtering signals such as removing noise from audio signals. For example, an RC circuit can control the blink rate of an LED or filter out unwanted frequencies in an audio signal. Here's what we learned today. An RC circuit consists of a resistor and a capacitor. The time constant RC determines the charging and discharging speed. These circuits are widely used in timing and signal processing applications. That's all for today's video on RC circuits. If you enjoyed this tutorial, get a thumbs up and subscribe to Spark Plug Tech for more fun and educational content. Got questions or suggestions? Drop them in the comments below. See you next time.